All right, so while some were celebrating St. Patrick's Day with green, others were looking for the gold this morning. Thousands of runners explored a new course for the Publix Atlanta Marathon, and we were there bright and early to catch all the fun. Take a look. <laughs> No hangovers here. Before the sun even rose, 11,000 runners braced the cold and ran through some of downtown Atlanta's most iconic sites in their St. Patty's Day green. She has her ears. I have my glasses right here. Damon Rucker and Heidi Williams Cooper ran for fun, all to get ready for the other big Atlanta road race on a holiday. I'm trying to gear up for the, uh, the Peachtree Road Race in July. This was really exhilarating. The weather was awesome. We started, it was dark. The music was phenomenal. From bagpipes to DJs, there was plenty to distract from the three, 13, or 26 mile course. But nothing was distracting Andrew Hull from the finish line. Time wise, it was a little hilly, so I, I was a good 30 seconds behind my uh, PR, but I was happy with today. It's a little nippy out here, but uh, it was fun uh, running the streets this early and seeing the sunrise of the beautiful city. Brothers Brent and Kyle Pease run together every year. we got to make sure we are, our shades match. That's our big race tradition. Whether it was for time or just for fun, one thing's for sure, they've earned their green beer. The race was awesome. All right, speaking of races, it's a big year for the AJC Peachtree Road Race. This year will be the 50th running of the world's largest 10K race. Registration is now open if you want to be among the 60,000 runners this summer. I just head over to 11alive.com for more information on this. And while you are there, make sure you vote for your favorite race t-shirt design.